Hello everyone. Today I want to show you a way to apply rule based and field value condition formatting on a line chart that dynamic highlights the data point or you may say line markers in Power BI. Let's start the video. In the first part, we are going to apply rule based condition formatting. Step 1 Insert column chart, resize it. Now on the axis I want months and on the values I want total revenue. To divide this chart into small multiples I am going to use payment method and will put this payment method fields inside the small multiples option. Before moving to next step I want to highlight one thing. Right now we are in the column chart. If I switch to format your visual option, click on this column option, we can see conditional formatting option that is FX sign. Whereas if I change the column chart to line chart, I again shift myself to format your visual option and here I click on lines. From the lines I click on the colors. Here we can't find the condition formatting option that is the FX sign. Therefore we will start with the column chart and later on we will convert this column chart into a line chart. So now for the second step change this line chart to bar chart. Now we will again move to format your visual columns and from here we have the FX option. We will apply a rule based condition formatting based on total revenue. The first rule is if total revenue is greater than equal to zero in numbers and less than 500,000 then I want to show that number with the red color. More colors and here I will choose the red color. New rule. If my number is greater than equals to 500,000 in numbers and less than my maximum value then I want to show it with a green color. Okay, now for step 3, we are going to change this column chart to a line chart. Here we go, we have the dynamic line markers or you may say data points. In part 2, we are going to apply field value condition formatting to highlight this dynamic data points. For that, we have to change the step 2. And to change step 2, the first step is to create a major. And I am going to create this major in majors table. Right click new major. My major name is color code equals to if total revenue is greater than or equal to 500,000 then show me green color and for green color I am going to use this hex code. Else show me red color and for red color I am going to use this hex code. Now we are going to convert this line chart into a column chart to get that FX condition formatting option. Go to format your visual columns, click on this FX sign and format style we are going to use field value and from field value we are going to use our major color code. Okay and now again change this column chart to a line chart. That's it. We have done the job. To validate this method create a slicer. And in this slicer, I am going to use years field. Changing it to list from the format option. I am going to use horizontal 2020 and 2021. If you like this tutorial, share it with your friend. Let us know your feedback and suggestions for the future videos in the comments. See you in the next video.